My next guest has been saving lives as Dr. Bash on Canada's most watched drama series, Transplant. And he's now gearing up for season four. Please welcome Hamza Hack. Excellent blazer good, sir. Oh, thank you so much. And frames. I told you backstage, but thank they are so, so beautiful. Am I, am I allowed to say on like live where I got them? I mean, sure. They're boot like Ray Bans from Pakistan. Oh. Yeah. I I always have the tendency, anytime I talk to anybody, I'm like, nice, cool, whatever, mm -hmm. and it's always from somewhere I can't get them. Oh, exactly. Yeah. Hey, well, next time I go. There you go, yeah. perfect. You got, yeah. my, got my hookup. Yeah. That's amazing. Well, yeah. congratulations on the new season. Thank you so much. I am so, so thrilled for you. It is set yeah. in Toronto. It is. But you shoot in Montreal, am I right? We do. Okay, so. La Salle, for anybody who wants to be specific. Oh, we oui, are very, oh, from somebody, somebody from La Salle. Yeah. I saw someone go, Ooh. Amazing. I know it's usually top secret, but what are you most excited for about this season? Um, I'm excited for y'all to see it. Yeah. Honestly, yeah. It's uh, and um, I'm excited to read the like. Uh, at the time of filming, I have not read the season finale yet. Oh. So I actually, I actually don't know how how the season is going to end. Like exactly, I have an idea based on conversations we've had, but. I've only read up until episode nine of ten. So, do you do that on purpose, like, or, or does that kind of get fed no, out to you? It's I, I get the scripts when they're made available to me. Okay. So, uh, so yeah. So that's uh, the suspense is all courtesy of Joseph K. You know, everybody loves this show. It's such mm. an amazing show. You're so fantastic in it, yeah. which is proven by the fact that you, I believe, are the first male in history to win three Canadian Screen Awards in a row for lead performer, <laughs> which is huge. Yeah. It's absolutely amazing. Yeah. What does that recognition mean to you? Um, okay, so it, it's great. <laughs> it's great. It's it's lovely. I love external validation. My insecurity needs it. Yeah. I, I like it. Like, it, it's awesome, but ultimately, you know, you win the award and it feels great for 10 minutes until you have to go back to work and, yeah. and you have to prove yourself again and now you've essentially raise the bar for yourself and you, it's the, it's that it's that thing of shifting goalposts right mm -hmm. what i can say is what means the most to me is that um, all three of these awards are sitting on my parents fireplace um, and it brings them so much joy yeah. especially as you know like immigrants to the country who decided okay cool like my kid wants to be an actor and everything like that so i feel like it's uh, it's a culmination of a risk that they took 25 years ago and every year is like recognition of that risk and that support that they've given me. Yeah. yeah. So speaking of taking a little bit of a turn. Sure. Movies. Yes. So last year you made your debut at TIFF, correct? I think so, yeah. 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 Well, and then this year you've got um, you're back at TIFF with mm -hmm. the Queen of My Dreams. Yes. Which is amazing. Tell me more about this project and also the fact that I believe this is the first oh, is. thing that you've worked in where you speak Urdu. Yeah. And I believe it was filmed in Pakistan? It was, yes. Mm, that's so amazing. That's where you got yeah. the glasses. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I hadn't I hadn't been back to Pakistan in, in about 13 years. Yeah. Uh, so when, uh, you know, Fazia Mirza, she gave me the script and initially I turned it down because it was about, the log line was like, well, okay, Hassan, a trauma surgeon. And I was like, I don't want to play another trauma You're like, surgeon. like, I'm good. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> but it has nothing to do with the story. And then, and then as I read it, as I read what she wants to do with it and what the story centers around and it's sort of this not time travel thing but it's filmed over three distinct decades mm -hmm. um, and I get to play the same character over those decades mm -hmm. and uh, it's this beautiful mother-daughter story um, coming of age thing with you know played by uh, Nimra Butcha and the wonderful Amrit Kaur and and you know it's just so vibrant and they said you get to pretend to be a Pakistani doctor in 1969 yeah for a majority of the film and I jumped at the opportunity mm -hmm. to, to get to go back and be more than just, you know, Anwar and Zawara's son, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Just going to Pakistan, visiting family to actually go back to the country of my origin, yeah. contribute to a cultural exchange, learn how they work there and, uh, and have that entire experience as an adult, as an artist, it was, it was just a, a beautiful experience. Well, speaking of Bash, which fans know and love you as, mm -hmm. you play an ER doctor, mm -hmm. but I want to know how your OR skills are. Okay. Are you ready to Yeesh. face me in Operation? Is it, you're going to make me do this? We're going to play Operation right now. Okay, cool. Let's, Let's go. Let's do it. Okay. Let's go uh, right over here. All right. Okay. Uh, Okay, these are purely aesthetic. I'm these, okay. Actually, uh, I'm gonna get in the way. <laughs> okay, um, so I've been played this, this probably since I was about like four years old. You ready? I, okay, we gotta scrub up first. Okay, cool. 
getting the doctor thing, and then we walk in like this, I think I've seen. Yeah, I mean, yeah. if it's a sterile procedure. There you go, so sterile procedure. Okay, cool. Go. So we've got 30 seconds on the clock. Well, okay, so I'm, I'm actually never, I, it's, You're it, never it's remarkable. This has never come up. Okay, <laughs> so the moral of the story yeah. is you don't want to hit the sides. The sides it yes. will buzz at you. Okay, cool. But you want to get the things out of this poor man who's very sick. Okay, cool. Um, so we're going to help him, right. but so don't touch the sides. Luckily, we're in Canada, so his poverty has nothing to do with how what kind of healthcare he can No, receive. exactly. It's perfect. Okay, so we're gonna, get, man, we're gonna get we're gonna get we're gonna get these out, but don't touch the sides. If you touch the sides, you lose. It, like like one and done? No. Okay. Cool. Depending on who touches the sides the most. Okay. Because I'm not gonna I'm probably gonna touch the sides. All right, All right let's do this thing. Let's get 30 seconds on the clock. Can you count us in, audience? In three, two, one, go. go. All right, I'm pretty sure I just saw you cheating. Uh, thumbs up. I starting before. Oh no. Well, is that a toilet in its tummy? Got one. <laughs> okay. I'm, like, I'm like on my fourth one. Oh my I god, no, on. okay. <laughs> Y'all, I'm not good at this game. Um, oh, he's a frog in his throat. Actually, there's some good jokes in this game. I'm into it. Um, we're, oh, no, I didn't drop him. Oh my god, oh, I touched the side. Uh, did you just whoop my butt? How many uh, yeah. Okay, we got one, two, three, four, five, and there's a sixth one that's on the oh, ground. Oh, we go? almost tied it. We got go? five. Oh, that's six. There's one. I promise. I promise. You're always back there. He's back, back there. Here. All right. Oh, and it's a smiley face too. They, well, thumbs up. I dropped it again. Uh, first time's a charm. There you go. You're an operation master. That's now you can go in and be like, I'm part of the OR team. Absolutely. You got I think this. Hamza Huck, MD. There you go. Certified. We got on this. Yeah. Honestly, this is amazing. Thank, Thank you. you so so Thanks much. Thanks so much for having me. Transplant premieres this Friday, October 6th at 9 p.m. on CTV. Hey, Mary here. What did you think? Drop your comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more of the good stuff.